some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello, and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves somewhere out in Virginia, where a sovereign citizen is about to find out that they need a visit from Safe Flight Repair, Safe Flight Replace, because they took the advice of some guru who told them that it would be all right for them to travel without a license or a registration or even license plate or anything like that. So, yeah. Play stupid games, win stupid prizes. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. All right, Miss Ward, I'm going to explain something to you real quick, okay? So you have two options here. I can give you a summons. The vehicle's being towed regardless, and you can be on your way. Y'all are not going to steal my, my vehicle okay, today, second, sir. The second option. I'm self-employed. Everything I have in this car is for my business. If you take my car today, you're going to have a serious lawsuit. Okay, the, the second serious option. Serious lawsuit. The second option. This is quite a contradiction right here because in a few moments she'll be saying that she wasn't driving in commerce, but clearly she said that everything she has for her business is in this car, so therefore she is driving in commerce, So, which nullifies her stupid little argument about not being, not having to be insured or anything like that. So, uh, yeah, get with the contradictions and straighten them out next time before you pose this stupid little argument because this just fails on so many levels. I mean, Get real. Is we have to take you out of the vehicle. The vehicle still gets. That's towed. not gonna happen either. The vehicle. Still well, you're gets gonna towed. have to take me out okay, the vehicle can I explain then. It to you, ma'am. Go ahead. The vehicle still gets towed, and you go down to the jail and get charged with obstruction as well. I'm not obstructing anything, sir. There's no crime that's been committed. He's putting on. Oh, they're I've putting on the gloves. You the crime that was committed. They're you putting on the gloves now. I feel very threatened right now. I feel very threatened. I'm safe right here. I'm. I'm gonna. Exercise my Fourth Amendment right to stay okay. right in my vehicle. Like I said, I'm just letting you uh, well, your Fourth Amendment protects you from unreasonable searches and seizures. Uh, you violated Virginia law by not having any license plate, license, or insurance or anything like that, which is, well, against the law in every state in the Union. And, well, I'm sure if you go to a lot of other countries, they'll have, have requirements for it, too. So you can't get away with this anywhere in the world, really. Hell, you couldn't even get away with it in North Korea, where hardly anybody drives because, well, you have to go through a year's worth of classes in North Korea just to be able to drive. You know, your two options, either you go to jail today. I'm going to let you know your options. You let me carry on my way to travel that, that's freely, option, no. unmolested, or you're going to have a lawsuit. That's your options. Like I said, the vehicle is getting towed. You can either go to jail or I can give you some summonses and you could go. You're going to your kidnap way. me, you mean? Kidnap me? No. Yeah, that's kidnapping. Okay. I haven't committed any those crimes. Are the, those are the two options. Sir, I have not committed any crimes. I'll give you some time to think about Tell it. Tell me what it's crime I've committed. I told you you were driving without your license. I'm not plate. operating in commerce, sir. What don't you understand about that? I'm not operating in commerce. Okay, like I said, but you just said a little while ago you were operating your business out of this vehicle, which is essentially commerce. So, yeah. You just destroyed your own argument right there, and not to mention the fact that you are completely ignorant of Virginia laws regarding your driver's license anyway, so, yeah, just a dumbass all the way around. So those are your two options. I'll give you some time to think about it before the tow truck gets here, but one way or another, you're going to have to get out of the vehicle. What is he doing? I feel very threatened right now. Can you roll the cell talk to you? I can hear you just fine. Can you hear me? Yep. If you don't get out of the car, I'm just being a voice of reason, okay? We're going to have to damage this vehicle, and you're going to have to pay for the damages. Sir, okay? you're going to pay for the damages. And you're going to get injured coming out of the I am exercising my Fourth Amendment right. You're violating my rights. Are you listening to me? 
Are you listening to me? When we have to forcefully well, from the then you you're going to pay for the damage. You, you will be sued. That. You're paying for the damage. You will be sued that. if you hurt me you or my property, me? sir. Do you understand me? Sir. Ma'am, do you understand me? You're threatening me right now. I feel very threatened right now, sir. I feel very threatened right now. Ma'am, do you hear what I said? I feel very threatened right now by you. Are you listening to what I'm saying? Sir, are you talking over me? You listening to what I'm saying? You're threatening me You're right gonna now. You're going to get hurt, and this vehicle is going to get damaged when you come out of this. Are vehicle. you threatening to hurt me? If you don't come out of this vehicle. Are you threatening to hurt me? Are you threatening to hurt me? You are going to get hurt if you don't get. Are you threatening to hurt me? Are you threatening to hurt me? Might be hurt if you have to get forced removed from this. Vehicle. Are you threatening to hurt me today? She's got a knife in the center console, by the way. Oh, whoopee! It's a one-inch blade. Come on now. Well, there's the private plate right there. I wonder if she was too damn lazy to even put it on the back of her vehicle to begin with. But, of course, it's really too late to put it on now because they're about to extract her from the vehicle for her own stupidity. Y'all gonna, um... I do not plan on using my knife. Do y'all plan on using your guns? It's a two-inch knife. My God, can y'all see my hands? Y'all gonna trigger happy shoot my fucking ass today? Oh my God. Ma'am, like I said, if I am exercising my Fourth Amendment right, sir, to stay right where I am in the safety of my private vehicle. Okay, but you if cannot... you feel like you need to take me out and hurt me, you go right ahead and do that, okay? If that makes you sleep good tonight, go ahead and fucking hurt me right now, okay? I don't want to hurt you. Yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. Look at you, y'all. Y'all got gloves on. Y'all want to hurt me. Uh-oh, here he comes. Here he comes. Here he comes. Here he comes. This is really sad. We live in America. This is fucking sad. This is the sheriff's, our last defense of our rights, and they're violating every one of them. Oh, don't cry about your rights being violated when you have no idea what they are to begin with because you're about to cry about deprivation of rights under color of law when you don't even understand what that is to begin with because that's based on civil rights, you dumbass. In other words, being treated equally based upon your skin color, your race, your gender, your religion, everything like that. You dipshit, you are just so incredibly stupid at this point. I mean, go get yourself educated. Go read a real book instead of listening to these uh, gurus who are only trying to t fleece you for every dime you have anyway. And the uh, private plate over there on your windshield just tends to prove that that's exactly what they're trying to do. Title USC 8, Title 18, 241, and 242, Deprivation of Rights Under Colorable Law. I feel very threatened right now. I'm going to call 911 and let them know that I feel very threatened right now. <laughs> oh, wait, you serious? Let me laugh even harder. <laughs> this is your last chance to either... I feel very threatened right now. Y'all are planning on hurting me right now. They're planning on hurting me right now. Ma'am, no one's planning on hurting you. Yes, you are. You're violating my rights, sir. You are violating my Fourth Amendment right. I've already tried to explain it to you multiple times. I'm in a private parking lot. You were not when I saw you driving down Bell Creek Road. I am. Where am I right now? Right now, you're in a parking lot. I'm in a private parking lot. I observed you driving on Bell Creek Road and conducted a traffic stop. For no license plate being displayed. I pulled over before you even put your lights on, sir, so lie again. I pulled over before you put your lights on. Did I not? Did I not? I want to get y'all. I want to get y'all. He is fixing the... He is fixing it. Do you me? You, you are fixing to glass. cause me bodily injury right now. I don't want you to get hurt when we break the glass. You do okay? want Can me to get hurt. Get you wouldn't break my glass. Please, please right? Get out. We don't have to break the glass. You wouldn't break my glass. Can if you, you didn't out, want me to get hurt, glass. you wouldn't break my yeah. I'm I'm exercising yeah, a right yeah. that I have. You have a right to stay in the vehicle. You've got to get out. You've it's my Fourth Amendment right to be protected in my purse.
you violated Come on. your own rights. Do you know the Do you know the Constitution? You Did you take an oath to the Constitution? Did you take an oath to the Constitution? Did you take an oath to the Constitution? Did you? You're violating my I am safe in my private property. I do not want to get out. Y'all are threatening me to do me bodily damage to steal my property. Why can't you just write me tickets and let me be on my way? Because you can't operate this vehicle. I'm not way. operating a motor vehicle. I'm not operating a motor vehicle. That is a com commercial term. I'm not operating in commerce. As clearly... Uh, that's quite a contradiction right there. You just said a little while ago that you were operating your business out of this car, so therefore you are operating in commerce, which in the sovereign citizen world would be a reason for a commercial driver's license. So your own dumbass little argument right there doesn't really make too much sense when you think about it. But of course, I guess you just don't really think too much, do you? Displayed by my license plates. I'm not operating in commerce. Okay. I have a right to travel the roadways freely and unmolested. That's my God-given right. My rights don't come from men with fucking guns and badges. My rights come from God. I have a right to travel the roadways freely and unmolested. As long as I'm not operating in commerce, which I am not. The Supreme Court has ruled on it over a dozen times. Uh, yeah, we're going to need a citation on that. Not just saying that the Supreme Court has ruled on it, but the actual rulings, because, well, if the Supreme Court made that kind of decision, it would have hit the news a long time ago. But you know what? The only people, the only people that I ever see saying that are the sovereign citizen gurus on their own channels who actually will take you through the... Uh, rulings but they will quote mine they'll take one little sentence out of these rulings and claim that it is a binding ruling well in their minds that is but not in reality because it's just one little sentence in an opinion portion of the ruling y'all need to get your money made racket you got plenty of people out here operating in commerce i'm not one of them I'm operating in my, I'm traveling in my private automobile from point A to point B. Ma'am, I don't want to hurt your vehicle. Oh, yes, you do. Quit lying. You want to hurt, you want to hurt me? You want to steal my fucking car? Steal my money? You're not, um, I feel safe right here where I'm at. I'm exercising my fourth. Oh, my God. Look. Oh, look. Oh, my God. He is fucking... Oh, my God. Ma'am, get out. Oh, my God. Are you serious right now? Are you serious right now? Are you serious right now? Yes, you need to get out. Do you know how much damage you're causing to my vehicle? Are you... Are y'all serious right now? Y'all... Are y'all serious right now? Are y'all... All right, they're gonna break my glass. Here we go. They're gonna break my glass. I can break my glass. I don't want to hurt her. Oh, yes, you do. Yes, you do. You can't wait to get your fucking hands on me. Can't wait to get your hands on me. Look what they're... Oh, my God. Look what they're doing. Y'all are fucking savages, man. Ma if you get out what in the fuck? Back. I'm exercising my goddamn right. My Fourth Amendment right. Y'all are dangerous. I don't want to be out there with you lunatic fuckers. Are you kidding me? the fuck would I get out for? Y'all just gonna manhandle me and hurt me. Look, they broke my glass. They broke my glass. I have to pick up my granddaughter today. I have to pick up my granddaughter. Now y'all done broke my... Oh my god. Oh my god. This is, this is a... 
This is America, land of the fucking free. This is America right here, guys. This is America. Y'all are live, by the way. You're live. This is this is our, our finest right here, our finest. This is our fucking finest. This is the best we got right here. A bunch of fucking thugs. A bunch of goddamn thugs. Oh, my God. They done broke my window. Look at that. Broke my window. Fucking pried my doors. Look, they fucked up my car. Y'all are savages, man. Look at... Oh, God. Look now. Oh, my God. Y'all are savages. I hope you sleep good tonight. I hope you sleep good tonight. I haven't committed any crime. This is fucking unreal. Look at this shit. Fucking unreal. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. It's on the other side. Unfucking real. Unreal. Unreal. Oh my god. Ma'am, you're gonna get. He, he's gonna hurt me. He's gonna you fucking get hurt me. Before you get hurt accidentally by the Can you stop, please, you fucking you savage bastard? I promise. Oh my god. Get out of the vehicle. What in the fuck is wrong with you? You're obstructing so getting this out of the way. Get out of the vehicle. Get out of the vehicle. Back up away from me. You're under well, stupid is as stupid does, and well, a lot of these soft tards are, well, a few cans short of a six pack, and uh, incredibly, incredibly dumb. And uh, well, apparently, this one was also not very confident in her argument either because I tried to go back to her video, but she's removed it off her channel. Thankfully, I downloaded before she did that, so. Yeah, not very confident in your position, are you, if you actually remove the video? But maybe she got smart, actually hired a lawyer, and the lawyer took a look at the video, and probably told her remove, to remove it off of YouTube because it would not exactly help her case because she definitely broke those uh, Virginia traffic laws. But you know what? Who knows why she did it? At any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?